द बीजेपी हैज स्क्रिप्टेड हिस्ट्री इन उत्तर प्रदेश सीएम योगी आदित्यनाथ हैज बिकम द फर्स्ट उत्तर प्रदेश सीएम टू गेट री इलेक्टेड इन थर्टी सेवन ईयर्स बट दे इज अनदर इंपॉर्टेंट फैक्टर हेयर एज कमंडल पॉलिटिक्स सीम्स टू हैव वन एट द एक्सपेंस ऑफ मंडल पॉलिटिक्स हाई एंड वेलकम टू टी एफ आई इंग्लिश द नेशनल सोशल पोलिटिकल एनालिसिस आर्म ऑफ द टी एफ आई मीडिया ग्रुप आई मे होस्ट पीयूष एंड इन दिस वीडियो आई विल टेल यू हाउ कमंडल की राजनीति हैज मेड अ डेंट इन टू मंडल की राजनीति Let's begin. The Uttar Pradesh Assembly poll results are indeed historic. This goes back to the days of emergence of two line of thoughts in Indian politics. Mandal politics of the late 1980s sought to create caste coalition of backward classes and Kamandal politics a broad strategy of the BJP to bury caste divisions and unite voters. For the past 30 years or so, politics in several northern Indian states especially UP and Bihar has been dominated by mandal kamandal binary on one hand there are regional parties and on the other you have the bjp however the 2022 up assembly poll results show that kamandal politics is gaining strength as voters got to consolidate under bjp's hindutva plank rather than getting divided into caste lines the dalit vote in up is divided into two segments jatav dalits and non jatav dalits BJP's development agenda helped it in gaining known Jatav Dalit votes in different parts of the state including Awadh and Purvanchal. Free ration, Ayushman Bharat health insurance schemes and housing for poor under PM housing scheme were some of the reasons that led to known Jatav Dalits and other sections of the society voting in BJP's favor. And then even more jatav dalits have voted in bjp's favor this time as compared to 2017 polls bsp has been traditionally popular among jatav dalits in 2017 87% of jatav dalit votes went to bsp and bjp got only 8% of the jatav votes but this time bjp's share rose to 21% as against bsp's 65% before the assembly elections a narrative was being weaved that bjp was a party of thakurs and brahmins will not vote for it but this myth stands shattered 89% of brahmins voted for bjp up from 83% in 2017 this may as well have been a turning point in the assembly elections before the polls all parties were said to be eyeing brahmin voters it was only natural since brahmins make up a significant voter constituency in the state next only to jatavs and yadavs in 2017 58% of non yadav obcs had voted in bjp's favor this figure has surged further to 65% this time around on the other hand 87% of rajputs have voted in bjp's favor against 70% votes in 2017 In the run-up to assembly polls, it was being said that BJP will not do well in Western Uttar Pradesh. Why? Well, it was being surmised that Jatavs, the dominant community in Western Uttar Pradesh, wasn't happy with the BJP because of the three farm laws and the agitation that followed. Western UP has a good concentration of farmers, which explains the narrative. However, 54% of Jats voted in favor of BJP alliance. the bjp has found more electoral support from the community as compared to 38% of jats that voted in 2017 assembly polls at the end of the day the idea of backward caste versus upper caste voters seems to have become anachronistic at least if we go by 2022 assembly poll results caste divisions have clearly got blurred and people of up seem to be in the favor of growth and development 